Hi, kids. It's me, Earth. Some people call me the world. Some call me the planet, and some even call me Mother Earth. But you can just call me Good Old Earth. Earth is the planet on which we live. Earth also means the ground. This is what I look like from outer space, from somewhere beyond our friend the Moon. Outer space is the area beyond Earth. The moon, stars, and sun are all objects in outer space. From outer space, I guess I look pretty small. You can see that I am mostly blue. That's because I'm mostly covered with water. But you can also see lots of green and brown. Those are the colors of the land where people live. Of course, I am also covered by a nice blanket of air. You can't see the air, but you can see the white clouds that float around in it. I've been here a long time, and I've seen many things. I just want to tell you that I am truly amazed by you people, and I'm glad you're here with me. You do so many amazing things. I like your farms and your nice little towns. I like the great big cities you've built. They're incredible. I don't even mind the roads you've built all over me. I like to feel your boats floating on my oceans, seas, and lakes, and your airplanes kind of tickle a little as they zoom through my skies. Most of all, I like you kids. I like to feel your little feet running around. I like to hear you laughing, and I especially hope that you enjoy and appreciate all the beautiful and amazing places on my surface. The surface of the Earth is the outer layer of land or the ground. Let's take a look at some of these places together. People live on land. But you are not the only living things that depend on or need the land. Animals, plants, and people all need to share the land with each other. The forests and grasses add such beauty to my surface. Of course, the flowers, trees, and grasses aren't there just to be pretty. They're important for all the creatures that live here. From the squirrels and birds that live in the trees to the bees that buzz around drinking nectar from the flowers to the animals that eat the grass, it's the same with rivers and other bodies of water, such as lakes and streams. They're nice to look at and nice to swim around in or paddle down in your canoe, but they're also home to many creatures, from fish. To snakes and turtles, to snails, and their waters are important in many ways for you people too. Here is a photo of the beautiful sky. On this day, the sun is shining brightly, and a few puffy white clouds are floating through the air. Every time you look up in the sky from now on, I want you to think of the air that's there. You'll want to listen very carefully when I tell you about keeping the air and skies clean. After all, the air is what you breathe every few seconds, every single day. Inhale and exhale deeply. <sighs> you are breathing air in and out, even though you can't see the air. People are the most intelligent creatures here on Earth. You're the ones who built big cities and invented cars and computers. You make medicines for people and animals, and you have schools and airplanes and many other important things. You people are truly amazing. You can do many, many things that no other living creature here on Earth can do. That gives you extra responsibility.
because you're the smartest, all living things depend on you to take care of me. So it's your job. You're expected to take care of the earth. You have to share the earth. You're in it together. I want people to truly enjoy living here. Every morning when you wake up and see the sunrise, I hope you will say, great, it's the start of another wonderful day on beautiful earth. To make sure that happens, I need to teach you about something I like to call taking care of the earth. I really need your help making sure that the air, water, and land stay clean so that you and all other things living here can be safe, healthy, and happy. And you kids can really do a lot to help out and to make sure that all the grown-ups do their part, too. So I hope you'll listen carefully over the next couple of weeks because I have a lot of important things to share with you.